Okay, we're going to do um, eyebrow tinning today. We have a few different types. Um, over here, these are an older one of a lash and brow tint. And it has the, the colors, the uh, applicator sticks, and then these little things you would put underneath the eye. To be able to, whoops, I guess you can see it there. To be able to uh, do for the eyelashes. Uh, this one is another eyebrow tint. And this one you're going to take a cap full of the uh, developer and one of the little capsules. You open them up, mix it together, and then paint it on. Follow your manufacturer's directions. These process within minutes. So it's like one to two minutes usually. Okay, so don't leave them on for uh, processing like the same time you would a color. Follow your manufacturer's directions for each. Make sure you read all of the precautionary things as well. Okay, the one we're going to use today is this got a free forward however you say it okay and I would have already cleansed her eyebrows because I wanted to clean them and make sure that they're dry um, so that's your preparation for the eyebrows and then you can use a little bit of petroleum jelly Vaseline if you want to to kind of put on my ears are really light <laughs> really light to protect the so that you don't get too much or that it doesn't stain the skin When you paint it on, I think it's easier to do it one eyebrow at a time. So we're going to just kind of do this as a little bit of a perimeter so that we don't get any staining on our skin. Okay, put that away. So we're going to take your first one, and you have your little step-by-step -step directions here too. You always want to look at this one. Um, this is the little applicator that comes with it, okay? And then we have three different choices. There's a medium brown, a dark brown, and a black for your color. So you're going to take a little bit of this, and again, you're going to apply it onto the tip and then paint it onto the eyebrow. And then this one, let it stand for one minute. Timer set. Can I recap that for me? Okay. Do you? Give this one minute. Wipe off my thing. And then we put this gel activator on and leave that one on for two minutes. I need that little ring thing that I have. Like the one, one for the eyelash thing. Do you know what that? The little new rings oh. that she got. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That'll work better to read down. It doesn't take very much of it. No. No, but that's okay. Oh, that'll work. There's another one that I had. It's a little thing that would work better. That way you can redo. This is one for nail art. But I don't know if I want to do it or not. Let's see. Okay, so now... Wait. 
wipe off the edge of the tube too so it doesn't and now we're gonna put the activator right over top of it. Whoa, is that making that come out now? <coughs> okay, set that timer. Two minutes is it. Just one more. Donnie you got eyebrows now. <laughs> need the first one, I guess, just to kind of get them wet. And then this one puts the color on it. She just doesn't have very many eyebrows here. Okay. Tissues. It looks weird. <laughs> Let's stand two minutes, and then you want to blot the eyebrows with a tissue or cotton ball. Remove any color that may have gotten onto the skin with a damp tissue. <coughs> She's very, very light. You want to get me a soapier one? With a little bit of like shampoo on it? Yeah, I don't really have like a dark blonde. Is what probably what we should have used for her, but one of the Okay. Oh, there's one over there, Ethan. Actually, that time it might have been pretty good for her. Okay. Here, look in the mirror. Can you see it a little bit darker? We might have been able to leave it on a little bit longer. Yeah. That could have stayed on a little It probably bit could have. I was just a little bit nervous because it was a... Yeah. Uh, Brown, dark color. A medium brown. It could be a light brown, but we only have medium brown, dark brown, or black. black. So. Let's do black. Okay. We can do the other side then, and you can stop. Okay. 